really know how, who to talk to about this shit because like if I tell my like IRL friends that know about this shit like <laughs> and I fucking cry to them about fucking like losing a teammate they're just gonna like you know they're not gonna understand like you guys watched it bro you guys watched our story bro <sighs> like you guys know how much this shit man Poured my fucking heart and soul into this shit. Into the fucking team, man. <laughs> I feel like I'm fucking crashing out, man. Like, I just started really processing it. Because I was just trying to make sure, like... <laughs> I feel like, I was trying to make sure enemies' mentals, like, good. Like, where his head's at. <laughs> and fuck, man. <sighs> I don't know. <laughs> it's like we had one bad week, man. <laughs> Which, like, I was already, like... I don't know, I was already going through shit, man. So I, I had an off week. Which I just... <sighs> compared to, like... <laughs> I don't know. And, like, all the pop-off moments and shit, like... I don't know. I just feel like I'm fucking crashing out. I don't know. I just need to like get it out. I don't. I don't know. I just need to like talk to somebody about it. Like, yeah, and you guys have watched it all. So I, like. I just kind of need like grieving, I guess, in a way. I don't know what the fucking word for it is, man. Closure, I guess. It's like a fucking. It feels like a fucking relationship, bro. Like, bro, this shit literally like feels fucking worse than a breakup, bro. I, like, I, I don't know if it's my fault for, like, going to trial. But, like, bro, like, that's the most winning team, bro. I'm friends with Jordan. Like, I don't, I don't know. Uh, I, I, I played two fucking days, and, I, and I, I knew, like, there was, like, I don't know. It was just magic, bro. When, like, something comes together like that, bro. <laughs> it's like, <sighs> oh, fuck, dude. I don't know. I'm gonna be able to do it, but it's gonna take a fucking lot, man. Yeah, but, like, it, it just doesn't feel like it was over, Tebow. <laughs> like, bro, it's not even like we had a bad, like, land. Like, I brought us back, it's a fucking one fight away. It's not like it never felt like it wasn't attainable. I mean, it, it kind of, I don't really have a like much say in the decision I don't feel in my opinion because like Timmy was kind of like enemies duo like that was his like their role so, like it would it just makes sense for enemy to be able to choose the player and I just kind of like guided them just like filtered in like entered if I had to anchored if I had to and I have no doubts in Zen. I think Zen is fucking insane. And like we're gonna make it work. Uh he was he's kinda like he's kinda like me or like enemy or or Timmy, um, in a bad way, where he got dealt with like shitty cards. You know? And like the people in this game they just fucking judge you based on your like last split. And uh they don't, people don't really look in like like how teams mesh and shit. So yeah, I mechanically he's fucking insane, and we're gonna be able to do it. But it just fucking just feels like like I I just need to like guess get closure on this first because like it just feels like the story wasn't over. So shirt. Like, I, I just, I, dude, I would literally write fucking novels to these motherfuckers. 
after like hot reviewing our shit when we were having like problems and shit. I would just fucking fill them with like delusional confidence at land and like like sit like say the right things and like. And I, I don't really know who to talk to about this shit, bro. If I, if I talk to my IRLs about this, they're gonna fucking laugh. <laughs> they, they've never had, like, like teammates and, like, something that, like... I mean, I guess, like, you know, like, in, like high school sports and shit, but... <laughs> like, how serious I take this shit, man. And, like, how much I pour into this. Like, I don't know. It's, just, like, hard, kind of hard for them to relate. Timmy tell me, Timmy didn't tell me he was leaving until yesterday. I can choose another counts. He didn't tell any of us. How long ago he got the offer? I don't know. Don't know. Yeah, I have no idea. If he would have stayed if if he turned it down, because his offer was insane, bro. Like, his offer's fucking insane. It'd be like troll not to. As much as we like, want to say like, oh, I would never fucking do it. Like, I know what he's got going on, like IRL and shit. So, and declined. Smells like victory. The offer, like when I. Literally had it. Like. <laughs> For sure. Yeah, it hurts, I guess, but like. I think. It's honestly best then, because. I don't know. Um. I don't know if, like, Timmy and Enemy would have been able to find somebody to, like, kind of fill the gap. And I feel like the same result might have happened and then Enemy would have been fucked. So. Maybe everything happens for a reason. Oh, we'll figure it out before fucking land, bud. I literally won't sleep until this shit's figured out. I'm not missing another one. I'm not gonna fucking just accept that we're fucked. Like I said, bro, no matter the fucking hole. No matter the fucking hole. We will dig it out. It's just how hard you gotta f how hard do you wanna fucking work? How hard do you fucking want it? Yeah, I want it hard. It's fuck, dude. Oh, there's no prospects. We're going with uh Zanow for the rest of the split. Um yeah. It's kind of it's it's hard. It's not it's not like I we can really I I can really prospect people um, timeline wise, and then also it's it's not like you can just fill like the, the way that we play the game, the way that I I, I jail the game. Uh, it's not like you just fucking throw somebody random in there. Um, I gotta work with them a lot and uh, explain it and like can't just randomly throw somebody in one time and like judge them based on that you need an mnk player that can counter call for sure bro you fucked i guess like because like timmy never really microed me but timmy would micro enemy around i need someone to fill that role to like help micro enemy around and kind of be on the same track with me but like also not fucking pull enemy to his fucking death it's a very unique fucking role that i don't know not many people are going to be able to Phil. I'm still fucking psycho. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking sad, but not fucking sad enough to fucking give that part up. Tweaking sack. I got us within one fight, two fucking lands in a row. You ain't gonna fucking trust my ass and you're gonna come in and try to fucking swap everything up? I ain't fucking with that. Maybe empty? I'm not picking up another IGL. Swear to god. I'm not fucking. Like, I would if they, like, wouldn't fucking question every fucking single thing that I said. But a lot of people will. That's just Apex, bro. All of us are fucking fucked in the head. Um, yeah, I wouldn't pick it. I don't know. It has to be 
like a smart decision. Like I said, honestly, it, it probably would be best being another IGO, but that just worked really well with me. But like, wouldn't like try to over overcome all my shit. Have I? Yeah, my exact Mazer. That was the worst goddamn thing in my fucking life. There was no, there was no overall plan. There was no fucking master plan. It was like all impulsive shit. Just it's like chaotic apex. It's just chaotic apex. I don't, I don't like playing the game like that. I'm very like calculated in the way that I play it. It's very fucking simple once you get it down. And you just need to execute. So I'm not getting IGL bullet. Why do you think that's why I said no to you? That's why I fucking said no to you, you piece of shit. That's why I didn't push for your ass. You're still saying, have you been IGL'd? Have you been IGL'd? Bitch, I was two fights away from winning. A, I, I was one fight away from winning a land twice. You're going to piss me off. You're going to fucking rile me up. You motherfucker. No. No, I have been IGL'd. Yes, I've given it up. I wanted to fucking lose my fucking mind. There's, I, I, I honestly like, I don't. I'm at like, uh, yeah. I, I don't think I would really respect anybody's fucking IGLing. There's very fucking few people. So I'm gonna sit there and give you the fucking proper play. And you're gonna do some dumbass shit. I'm gonna recommend the proper play. And then we're gonna do some dumbass shit, and I'm gonna sit there. And I'm gonna be like, fucking told you so. Fucking told your ass. I mean, we were fucking killing it in scrims before ALGS, before this last week. I kind of had like a, a, I had a rough week because I was going through some shit. Um, had a lot of shit weighing on me, um, with like family stuff and then uh, other matters. So I, I kind of had like a little bit of an off week, and then this last week it was just kind of like, um. I don't know. I don't think our heads were really in it. <clears throat> I mean, first week I was like, I, I I was dialed. I mean, you guys saw it first week. I was fucking dialed. I just wasn't like over. I wasn't overbearing. I wasn't overtaking like the comms. Like too much, you know. I was kind of just going with the flow. I don't know who said it earlier, but like. Fuck, bro. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to fucking go back in the bottom and watch low key. That shit brought my head out of it. That fucking definitely is recovery. It said, like, uh. Like I've always said, we set the story, bro. The story now is, like. If we win now, bro. Holy fuck. We win now? Holy fuck. This goodbye video got a brother emotional. Fuck, bro. Yeah. Uh, if you don't, don't go watch the beginning of my stream, Swell. Don't go watch the beginning of my stream, brother. I think I balled for an hour. No, not an hour. Like 30 minutes. Let it all out. Um, got my closure. I gotta fucking cycle through these fucking emotions. I gotta fucking lock it the fuck in though. Um, if we have any shot at fucking making this land, I have to fucking... I can't just sit here and fucking sulk. I can't sit here and be sad about it. I can't. I gotta fucking talk about it with everyone. Figure it out. But I need to fucking lock it. Otherwise, it's unfair to whoever. It's, it's unfair to enemy. It's unfair to fucking Zenial who's taking a shot at this. Um, unfair to you guys. I don't fucking absolutely fucking rebound from this and lock it the fuck in. 
the easy the easy way out is just to roll over and say that that completely fucked us and, and you know shift the blame and, and fucking say and and like say like we need time you know and we we just take the easy way out like oh it was a shock like uh, yeah I mean, we could take the fucking easy way out some pussy ass shit never taking the fucking easy way out time to get in the motherfucking gym I called enemy today uh, or last night after scrims cause like he was messaging me during scrims and he was like uh I don't even know exactly what he said he was just saying like he can't focus and he feels like shit I know he was watching Timmy and shit and uh I like called him to like make sure he was doing good and, you know talk to him about it all kinda give him that speech I just I, I gave you guys as long as he fucking trusts in me as long as as long as he still has trust in me this is doable and when he answered the phone he's fucking walking back from the gym bro this motherfucker walks to the gym this motherfucker walks 30 minutes to the gym bro and I was like alright bet we've taught him well we have taught him well yes yes Anakin good <laughs> type shit see let's go that's what I'm saying get in the gym son yeah, I was I was talking to my chat earlier as well. It's kind of bullshit. Now I have to be like reformed and shit. Like can't yell at fucking enemy now, cause I I knew like I could like just be passionate about the mistakes, which I mean I still be passionate about it, but I still can't fuck with him because I knew Timmy would just de-escalate de it. So it just caught it was like a little bit of content, you know, it's fun. But like I didn't even yell at him today, like he like made a mistake today and like he just started instantly beating himself up and I was like oh yo chill I was like chill the fuck out bro fuck <laughs> fucking tweakazoid he was literally the sole reason I did message him and wanted to team with him and he's like yeah I'm with Timmy though is that cool and I was like I kinda had the same um uh, same outlook at it as uh, a lot of other pros on them. Like I said, I've I've done it in the past. I've judged people on their their most recent um, pro league splits. And I wasn't. It wasn't like I was not down for it, but I wasn't like the most excited. Not gonna lie. I was like, huh? Yeah, yeah. Fuck it. I'm down to try that. He knows I respect his game. Did any other free agents hit you up to guys to play? Um, a lot of people hit us up to play. I'm not going to leak anything though. The decision, for the most part, came up to like Enemy and Bronzy. I thought uh, Bronzy, I let him give his insight who he thought would be the best. Um, and uh, came down to like Enemy who he, I thought he would work well with because I honestly, no matter who, who it is, like I'll be able to make it work, but whatever Enemy's most comfortable with. Because, like, that's kind of, like, the way we play. Like, they're... I'm either... I'm, like, flexing around what they're doing. Like, a tra tra traditional, like, person taking space, enemy anchoring, and I'm flexing around, either helping with space, helping anchor. I'm just... I'm just literally flexing around what they're doing. I was just not sleeping. I definitely needed that, the, that first 30 minutes of the stream. Alright, bro. Don't think bro should drive right now. Chill out. It's not my first fucking high school relationship, bro. I'm not thinking about fucking anything crazy. Chill the fuck out, bro. It is a fucking breakup, Cherish. It is. I think I, I think I cried more about this than any of my. Uh, I think there was only one breakup in my life that I cried more than uh, that shit, man. Fuck, dude, don't make me fucking do it again, piece of shit.